we have seen how to call a single API in JavaScript. But what if your interviewer gives you a list of such APIs and asks you to call all of them at the same time? This is where promise.all comes in. Let's understand it in under 30 seconds. First of all, we'll pass all of these fetch calls into an array. Why? Because promise.all takes an array of promises as an argument and waits for all of them to resolve. So we'll just pass this array inside promise.all. Okay, now after that, we use the dot then syntax like before. But now remember, we are not just dealing with a single API, we are dealing with multiple APIs. Okay, and all of them are in an array as we saw above. Okay, so we will have to iterate over each of these responses. The way we do that is using the map function in JavaScript. So, and what we are doing over here is we are iterating over it and we are applying dot JSON to each one of them. Okay, but now this is also not enough since dot JSON also returns a promise. We wrap the whole map inside another promise dot all. And that is what we are doing over here. And then finally, we will use the dot then syntax to get us the final data, which will be nothing other than the array of the API results that we are calling. So let us check our code. So as we can see, we have the results of all the endpoints. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more and drop a like if you found this video helpful.